Okay, again, we're asked to factor completely. We have 8m cubed minus 20m squared minus 12m. And the first thing we notice is that we can factor out an m, but we can also factor out uh, 4 from all of these terms. So let's divide out a 4m. And what's left is 2m squared minus 5m minus 3. And we're going to keep our 4m and somehow we need to factor what's left in the parentheses. We have 2m squared minus 5m minus 3. If we're, we use our trick of multiplying these outside numbers, we have 2 times 3 that gives us 6. We need to find factors of 6 that will add or subtract to give us a negative 5. So if we look at 1 times 6, we know that 1 minus 6 equals negative 5. So we can rewrite this as 2m squared plus m minus 6m minus 3. And you see this middle part, m minus 6m equals negative 5m. So we're just rewriting that. And now we're going to factor by grouping this middle term. So we're going to look at our first two terms in the parentheses, 2m squared plus m. We can divide out an m from both of those. So we're, what's left is 2m plus 1. And now we're going to look at the second two terms, and we can divide out a negative 3, and what's left is 2m plus 1. And now all that's left to do is rewrite this, and so our 4m is still out in front, and now we can factor out this 2m plus 1, um, and what's left is m minus 3. So our solution, our, the how we factor this completely is 4m times the quantity 2m plus 1 times the quantity n minus 3. So our answer is option C.